These high school boys and girls are having a hop at the local soda fountain. Innocently, they dance. Innocent of a new and deadly menace lurking behind closed doors. Marijuana, the burning weed with its roots in hell. Oh, how the times have changed. That was considered marijuana education in the 1930s, and it's a far cry from Colorado's latest educational pot campaign launched this month. Called the Good to Know campaign, it uses a combination of rhyming quips and a bright color palette to tell Coloradans the laws regarding marijuana use. The campaign's price tag, $5.7 million. But the campaign might be worth it. As it turns out, not a whole lot of folks in Colorado are aware of the laws regarding legalized marijuana. According to USA Today's Trevor Hughes, an early survey found only 27% of Coloradans knew it was illegal to smoke marijuana in public. Only 23% were aware it can only be sold to those 21 and older. A writer for the Denver Post says the ads are part of Colorado's broader attempts to dismantle pot stereotypes and educate folks on safe marijuana use. Last year, the state tried a much darker pot educational campaign called Don't Be a Lab Rat. The campaign, which featured human-sized rat cage displays, wasn't exactly well received. One particular emphasis by this latest campaign, a reminder that it's illegal to take pot outside the state, may have been prompted by some recent interstate drama between Colorado's neighbors to the east. Last year in December, both Nebraska and Oklahoma filed a lawsuit with the U.S. Supreme Court over Colorado's marijuana legalization. According to the lawsuit, both states say Colorado's legal pot is leading to problems within their own states by way of costing them taxpayer money for more marijuana-related arrests. But the lawsuit might prove fruitless as more states legalize marijuana in some form or another. 23 states have so far, with both Washington State and Alaska voting in favor of legalizing recreational use last year. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrus.